let's take a look at how we can use an article we've already discovered to help us find more on a similar topic. This article, published in the Journal of Retailing and Consumer Services, is examining behavioral traits of mobile phone users. I can see that from reading the title, abstract, and keywords shown here. If I'm interested in this topic, I could certainly use the keywords to do another language-based search for this topic. But there's another way that I can discover more literature like this. Looking in the Citation Network section of the article record, I see that this article is newly published and hasn't been cited yet, but I can look at the 118 cited references from its bibliography to find research that came before it. I can use these references to discover other material in Web of Science. When I click View Related Records, the search engine looks for any other articles across the Web of Science core collection that have also cited at least one of these 118 articles. If other articles cite the same literature, they're probably topically related to this one. You'll see from the articles in the results set that these are all related to the psychology and behavior of mobile phone users, but we found them not by keyword searching, but through the power of the citation links that the author provided for us. These are organized by the number of references these articles share in common. The first article shares eight references with the original article we were viewing. The second one shares six. The list is in descending order by number of shared references. I can click the number of shared references to see which ones they both cite in common. So Related Records is another tool for exploring the citation network for search and discovery.